What's the deal, y'all? We're Trapper Tapping in TNN Trap News Network, and we back in action with another reaction video. Y'all know the deal, man. Y'all know the deal. Y'all know the deal. We back in action with a reaction. Back with that action with these reactions. Yeah, man. Like, comment, subscribe for more of this content. If you ain't did that, make sure you do that. Hit that subscribe button. Become a part of this rich Trapper Mafia. Hit that notification bell right there at the top. Hit all. Stay tapped in for the latest and the greatest of what we got going on here at TNN Trap News Network. News you can use, knowledge you can't get in college. Find me on all streaming platforms. Rich Trapper Game 6. Rich Trapper worth more than money. Rich Trapper, I'm better off without you. Plus, my new singles, Start From Scratch and A Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, they both are both out now as well as my uh, newest project. I'm still better off without you go get that find me on instagram trap news network t-r-a-p-n-e-w-s-n-e-t-w-o-r-x that's trap news network um hundred dollars fifty dollars two different ways best comment for the month of february will receive a fifty dollar cash app the top commenter between now and the time we get to five thousand subscribers will also receive another five uh fifty dollar subscribe cash app so make sure you subscribe comment like wiki band watch and all that today we got a good reaction man we got a milagano to gilagano that's right milk seven four Seven fold or three oh four. Um, rapper calls podcast and crashes out on co host for calling his music trash. What he's talking about is 03 Greedo crashing out on Poetic Flacco. So we finna go ahead and give y'all this good reaction to uh Milagano to Gilagano 2 1. Let's go. It's milk TV, it's milk gang. Y'all already know how it's gonna go. Let's get our minds right before we get into this. Come on. Milk looked like a Mickey Mouse Hell's Angel, bro. I always say that. He looked like if Mickey Mouse was a Hell's Angel, it'd be Milagano the Gilagano. Milagano the Gilagano. Milagano the Gilagano. Shout out to the subtitles to the deaf homie who be watching. Look, check it out. I'm back on the clock full time putting these hours in. Now look, we got another reaction. 03 Greedo. Cost poetic flaco and crashes out on him. So we gonna go and we gonna see what's the script. Come on. Oh, oh wait, who's calling you? Oh, uh, Greedo calling me right now. Oh, All right, put the headphones on. Look at the setup. Oh, three, oh, three, hold on. Yeah. I, I, I'm on the plane, but I'm like walking off. I, I want to FaceTime you, but I'm walking off. But I, I don't want him to leave. Yeah. Where where Flacco in here? He right here. Can you hear right me here. on the Greedo? I love you, Flacco. Yo, no, no, no. I'm talking about music. I want I yeah. wanted to be meaner to you, Flacco. You hear me? I wanted to be meaner to you. Yeah. But it's listening to the too. podcast, I understand your point of view. So I don't want to just super do that. Yeah. I do want you to understand something, right? Okay. Before we talk about music, I want you to. You know where I'm from? Yeah. Watts. <laughs> no. Yeah, that's not what he was asking, Big Dog. He was saying like, I'm gonna tell you where my grandma stay. You're going to tell me where your grandma stay. I'm going to tell you where I'm from. You're going to tell me where you from. Lift your shirt up because you got some tattoos. Pull cuz pants up. He might got a thigh tat. You know what I'm saying? That's what he was saying. So he asked like where he was from. He was asking where he from. You feel me? So yeah, that's that's that. You know where I'm from? What? No, like what? Like 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 the gang stuff? Or, or uh, like where uh, you from? So yeah, the gangster. The gangster. Oh, uh, again... I heard from people that you. Now, what 03 Greedo just said right now was fit in the Gilligan activity category. Cause it's like, bro, like, why? Like, I can't stand people like that. Okay, we get it. Yes. What you're doing would actually fit in the Milagano Gilligano category because what he's doing and what he's saying has absolutely nothing to do with Milagano the Gilligano. You feel me? So if 03 Greedo want everybody to know that he is from Grape and that's what he represents, the same way you let everybody know that you from 7-4 Hoover, there really is no difference, big dog. You feel me? So if he's a Gilligano, you're a Gilligano. Milagano. You from somewhere. You're the type of Gilligano who makes comments and deletes it because you're really a 304 buster and you're scared of any type of consequence or any type of confrontation. But I ain't going to fight you, big dog. It's just YouTube to me. I ain't tripping. I'm not finna get all up in arms and rah over a YouTube video because you see, like that, no matter how, how many times I do it, no matter how many times I try, I'll never be able to jump through the screen and actually physically put my hands on you, big dog. I don't have the skills or the technology or the steady hand. You know what I'm saying? Just like I'm sure you don't have the skills or the technology or the steady hand. You feel me? We could all day. We could 
do, 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 all day, but we'll never be able to jump through these screens. So why get mad at somebody on the screen? You finna be spitting all, ty uh, typing aggressively. Them thumbs are going crazy. I'm gonna say it in all capital letters with an exclamation point so I know he's upset. Milagano to Gilagano, stay on my comments. And if you gonna drop a comment, leave your comment there and don't be a 304 and turn tail buster. Belong to a group or organization, but like- And no matter what, you can't tell me that Milagano the Gilagano doesn't look like Hell's Angel meth smoking Mickey Mouse. If Mickey Mouse smoked meth and was a biker, it would be Milagano the Gilagano. Man, like when you get into it with somebody, like especially a civilian, a non affiliated civilian, why the first thing you gotta say, hey, because you, you know where I'm from, right? You know where I'm from, right? Like, that's like a tactic to pump fear in somebody's heart. No, where I'm from, right? Milk, Milk, what would you know about pumping fear in anybody's heart, big dog? Ain't nobody scared of you. You can't scare a two-year-old on Halloween. Like, bro, you know nothing about pumping fear into anything. All you know about is the Kool-Aid that pumped through your veins, but it's cool. It basically me and him saying, like, you know where I'm from, right? It basically me, you know I got a group of men and women that's going to go with me, right? They gonna... Is that why you was always so big on letting everybody know where you was from? Because, never mind, never mind. Milagano to Gilagano. Crash out for me and with me, right? You know that, right? Uh, that, that's, that's Gilligan activity. I'm great, but I, I don't want to, like, assume. <laughs> okay. No, me either. I don't want to assume it either because I'm on parole. But listen here, bro. Yeah. You can't, you can't just talk to everybody like you talk to everybody. I want you to, I don't want to say it like I'm bullying you, bro, because yeah. I really want to call him bullying. Say that. I want you to understand something. So, Milagano to Gilagano, you just did all that trying to discredit O3 Greedo, a white man trying to tear down these black kings. I'm just playing. I ain't finna go there. I ain't finna go there. But you are Gilagano. And the first thing O3 Greedo said is, I don't want to sound like I'm bullying you because 3 Greedo is leaving room for conversation and dialogue. He's actually not trying to put a hardcore press on Poetic Flacco. So, Milagano, you're a Gilagano. Don't do that, white boy. Me personally, I shake the no, you hear me? Yeah. Like, without my hood. And then I'm a, a big head honcho from my hood, you hear me? Yeah. Like, my name is a street. So, that. for one, you can't even talk crazy. Mm -hmm. But since you're talking about music, let's focus on the music. Yeah. All these county, you're talking about them, my babies, you hear me? Yeah. Then my nieces and nephews, because I love Snoop, but he wasn't here for us like I am for you. Yeah. So three one zero baby, even the, that's from the other side. You feel me? I speak to them. We might not be able to do a song, but I still speak to them. So some of that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like you know what's going on in the streets. Yeah, you, you know we why you can't do yeah. a song. You, man. Milagano the Gilagano. That's not how that works. It's a lot of people who I deal with that I speak with. Let's use. My fans, my followers, my subscribers, my family of this rich trapper mafia. Somebody hit me today and I, I F with you off the camera. You know you my fam. I love you to death. But what you offer me, I can't be a part of. And I explain to you why I can't be a part of it. Because it just ain't for me. You feel me? I want you to get everything that's for you. But what you offer me just ain't for me. You feel me? So somebody doing a song with somebody. People do songs with people they, they don't like every day, B. People do songs with people they love every day, B. So, oh, well, you F with him, why you don't do a song with him? That's not how it works, Milagano to Gilagano, but that shows how naive and, and, and ignorant you are to this music industry. Just be quiet, Gilagano. Continue to be a Milagano, you feel me? And shout out to your girl for having that nice penthouse, a uh, nice apartment that she let you live in because you don't got no chili. So shout out to her because she got her edge together. So shout out to that beautiful black queen who likes to dip, dip into the milk of magnesia, you feel me? I'm telling you is, bro, you discourage in my city when you say that. And I know you don't mean to, and I wanted to tell you a different way. That's AD to show you my Texas. I wanted to tell you a different way. Yeah. But listen, bro, they're my babies, bro. And what you don't know, what you look at, you out the outside looking in, bro, I'm the only nigga. I ain't been out a year yet, but I'm the only nigga from Cali that got these fashion deals. I'm the only nigga from Cali that went double platinum, multi platinum in prison. Yeah. You feel me? Of course, same off. Yeah. So didn't do what I did. I went platinum in the city. Yeah. That man, that man was born in that man was born in Harlem and raised in Baltimore and New Jersey or some shit. You hear me? Yeah. I'm from Ray. You know what I mean? I was raised in California. Yeah. And I'm just saying this with respect because I like how you was talking. But listen, bro, I know you don't get it, and no jumper is my family. But when I
O3 Greedo's making some really good points. And you can't take away the accolades and the success that this man has. So, Flacco, you, number one, you some fat, weird white boy from, like, the middle of nowhere America. And you come around trying to dick ride Dejan Paul, who's also a, he's always wrong, fat and wrong. Dejan Paul's a loser. But you try to dick ride Dejan Paul and kind of do what he do. Oh, LA music, LA music. Bro, go home and talk about that. You feel me? Shout out to every artist coming out of California. Shout out to every artist coming out of LA because all we can do is continue to support our own. And, and L3 Greedo made a good point. You discouraging our city. You discouraging what we got going on because we live in such a social media world. I hate to say it, but a dude like Flacco who probably got beat up and picked on in high school and could have never made it because we would have been flipping his backpack inside out doing all kind of stuff to him now has an opportunity to kind of like get his get back at those who were way cooler than him and he, and, and he knew he couldn't be accepted by it. So now he's getting his get back, as he should. I can't even get mad at somebody for getting their lick back. But with that all being said, you're just being a hater for the sake of being a hater. Dejon Paul's a hater for the sake of being a hater. How are you constantly judging somebody of what you yourself cannot do? You a Milagano to Gilagano, just like Milagano to Gilagano. You feel me? The music thing. I had a famous freestyle to the Magnolia beat from Playboy Cardi. Me and Playboy Cardi was managed by the state yeah. Playboy like Cardi from Atlanta, ASAP is from New York. Cali shit, it's them niggas that were just putting these bad positions because of what happened with Snoop. And these niggas that wasn't from Cali, these niggas from Philadelphia and New Mexico. Yeah. Whatever was going on, it made a bad shit. He's talking about corrupt and exhibit. Corrupt is from Philadelphia. I'm sorry, corrupt is from Philadelphia and exhibit is from New Mexico. Corrupt, and it's super not fair for you to say that when they're. Who are you talking? Who, who are you just missing? Snoop? Or, I mean, he said Philly, that well, that's corrupt. And New Mexico, who is that exhibit? I don't lie. When I was a toddler, like a young grasshopper, before I really knew any damn tomorrow, when I just used to hear this music and then see them on the videos, I thought that they was real. He's talking about when he was just a carton of milk before he made it to be in a full gallon of milk. That's right. Philly from California, bro. Like, I ain't taking nothing from them, but I thought, man, I thought that they was like born and raised in like Los Angeles, Long Beach, watch like California. But let me know, this sound like 03 Greedo is telling Flacco, hey, you gotta be biased when it comes to me or mine. That's not what it sounds like, Milagano to Gilagano. What it sounds like is exactly what he said. You're being an unnecessary hater and you're discouraging the city. He didn't say that you had to be biased. He didn't say that you had to F with anybody, blah, blah, blah. He said that you're just being an absolute hater, which is an actual fact. So it's not what it sounds like, Milagano to Gilagano. It sounds like you're some weird little white boy who's trying to stir up controversy and trying to make a little wooty bam, blah, blah, blah. But in actuality, you stay tucked up in your girl's, in your girl's house where she keeps you safe at night and she probably cuddles you when she's the big spoon. You a carton of milk, big dog. She's actually the gallon. So let me take that back. She's the gallon of milk in the house, big dog. You're the carton. Bro, it's stay at home, dog dad. Or it's on. It's an issue. I'm going to whoop your feet when I catch you in the streets. That's, that's, that's bananas. You ain't want no baby out. Fuck anyone else. My little bro, they want no baby. Is the biggest thing besides Roddy Rich. Those are the two biggest artists we ever have. Fuck what Greedo do. I'm for the streets. I'm yeah. the only nigga really selling kilos or slapping niggas in their mouth. So I'm going to slap you. But since you came with respect, I'm going to come with respect. But I'll slap you if I was right there. Slap me I'm in Detroit because you can't talk to me like you talk to everybody. You lucky I ain't there. Or I'll slap you. It's hilarious. Yo, you didn't realize when that nigga Adam posted this, this shit, no nigga from Cali mentioned nothing about it? What? For one, I ain't no shit, but for two, more importantly, nobody want to fuck with my hood. Nobody want to play with us, because you don't know that because you're not from County. So you didn't, you didn't grow up thinking the West Coast music part going away from it like I did. I never liked none of that shit besides Snoop. I thought all that shit was weak. So I grew up listening to Lil John, Lil Wayne, and all these outcasts, all these dope niggas. It wasn't because they was from the South, because this was the dope music I went with Jim. So I'm just saying this, and I'm going to keep... You sound on the podcast, but I'll slap the shit out you in any other podcaster. Brick Baby's my brother, so I ain't talking about Brick. That's my twin. But other than that, bro, and AD and all these niggas that I really vouch for and jump on their shit, bro. Oh. Now, that's my issue. He's saying, I right, get off on any podcast or just get off on anybody. Hey, bro, hey, we know what happened to you. All we got to do is, like, kick you in your head. <laughs> Milk, you're saying we. 
on behalf of podcasters, why do dudes always wee, 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 wee? This ain't French class from Wax Snitch Honey. You know what I'm saying? Officer Rat Snitch Honey can't stand on him. Well, wee, 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 wee. Officer Snitch Hunter himself. Well, wee, 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 wee. Milk, wee, wee, wee. This ain't no French class, big dog. How come nobody stands on an I, a me? I said, I will. Why is it always a we? Like, what's up with all this strength and numbers? All we got to do, man, what, nigga? All you got to do. Go handle that, white boy. Go handle that. Don't don't, don't bring us here at TNN Trap News Network into your flu flammery. We over here trying to smoke weed and kick it. You go handle that, white boy. Make make your me into a we. Flip that me upside down. and Flip that we upside down and make it a we, big dog, and, and go handle your scandal. While you look at, look at that stupid face like a smoker. Look at him. Looking like, looking like a smoker. Wait, hold on, let me get the bone. There it go, right there. Wow. Looking like a smoker. That right there. Looking like a crystal meth addict. Mickey Mouse the Mickey Mouse the meth smoker. Mickey Mouse the <laughs> Mickey Mouse the meth mouth. That's what he looked like. Mickey Mouse the meth mouth. That's what he looked like. Mickey Mouse the meth mouse. I like that. I like that. No, you know what I like better? Mickey Mouse the meth mouth. Not Mickey Mouse the meth mouse. Mickey Mouse the mess mouth. Words are hard. Say that five times fast. Mickey Mouse, Mickey Mouse the meth mouth. Say that five times fast. But that's what milk look like right there. Looking stupid. Mickey Mouse the meth mouth. <laughs> hey, no, but for real, I don't like this energy. Like, I don't like this phone call because, you know, you're doing the same. You know what you're going to do about it? Absolutely nothing. Thing that you tried to press like a uh, uh, AD. And Wendy the pun for, you know, when you went on back on feet, you tried to press people and say, oh, y'all better not touch Desto. Nobody better not touch him. He ain't from nowhere. He don't do nothing. He don't bother nobody. So what if he laughed? So, so what if Flacco is giving his opinion on West Coast rap? I'm from the West Coast. Most of the West Coast music is trash. Most of the music in the current day. Actually, that's not true. Actually, that's actually not true at all. So that's actually what you're talking about. You're just like, I don't know when it became a trend and a thing for people from California, especially to hate on other people from California. When people from LA became big haters on the people from LA. Like, no, West Coast music is not trash. LA music is not trash. Bay Area music is not trash. It's not. You feel me? You tripping, bro. It's trash. I don't even listen to 03 Greedo music. I would low key categorize most of his music as trash. It's probably like two or three songs that's good, but the majority of the other shit is like, nah, 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 nah. can't even understand it. So, you know, you, you can't do that. The flock go and then say, can't nobody say nothing to Desto because he's laughing when, you know, people is getting talked about. Come on, you can't do that. that. That's not playing it fair all across the board. Now that is true. That is true. I'll give him that. When 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 uh Milagano the Gilligano has a point, Milagano the Gilligano has a point. You are pressing Flock uh Flacco the way that Desto got pressed. So if it's all for one and one for all, it's all for one and one for all. Or if we selected politics, let's just submit and stand on selected politics. I'd be I'd be biased with my reporting. Certain people I just never talk about. Certain people I just won't talk about because it's my platform and it's my folks. So I ain't gonna talk bad about them. So I'm standing on my bias. I am biased. I am hypocritical and I do double standards because yes, I'm a human and that's what happens. But I stand on it. I admit it. And guess what? I don't give a CK about it. But Milagano to Gilligano is making a Milagano of a Gilligano point. Desto, I mean, uh, Greedo, you doing the same thing to uh, Flacco, which what was done to Desto. Not exactly with the same intensity, but the same intent is there for sure. If you're going to be fair, be fair. Like, be fair. Like, that's crazy. But, but life ain't fair. Life ain't never that. So as grown men, but maybe Milk doesn't understand that because he's white. But us being black men, we understand that life is never fair. Maybe Milk doesn't understand that 100%. And he thinks that life is fair somewhere down the lines, but it's actually not ever that. Be fair. Like, be fair. Um, you know, and there's some people on here that said, oh, three Greedo wasn't raised in Watts. I'm not saying he ain't from California, but they said he wasn't raised in Watts. They said he was from Gardena, and his name was Greedy Giddy. You know, but, like, it's no issues with 03 Greedo. But 03 Greedo, like, every minute, it's like he's saying something like, yeah, you know, because I'm from somewhere. 
You know, being my homies and me and my homies and me and my homies. What about me and me? You know what's iron the irony about that? I just literally broke that down maybe about five minutes ago. If you didn't see it, go ahead and rewind it. Um, you're saying, what about me and me? The first thing you said was all we have to do. So we don't want to hear anything like that coming from you, Milagano to Gilligano, because in real time, you're actually being a hypocrite. And it's crazy because I was able to say it in a video, and now here you are contradicting yourself being hypocritical. So, Milagano to Gilligano, yeah, there's that. Me and me, like, it's just me. You know, like, but other than that, I don't know. And he said, didn't know people in California speak up when uh, Adam 22 posted his snitch paperwork. Now, he keeps saying... Adam 22, this, his family and all this, but Adam 22, the one that posted it. Why would Adam 22 post it? If that's your family and you rock with him and you, you solid like that and y'all dapping up every day, then why would he even post that? Why would he even let it come his way? He could have ignored that. He didn't have to post that. And people did speak up on that. They did, bro. But it's just like the streets is messed up. Because all you got to do is have some dough, some bread, some stacks of money, some clout. And you'll be okay. Like, you could really, I, I mean. My bad, y'all. My phone was ringing. Some chili was calling. But let's get back into it. Three, two, one. Let's go. Like that, and y'all dapping up every day. Then why would he even post that? Why would he even let it come his way? He could have ignored that. He didn't have to post that. Now, I will say that's true. You know what I'm saying? You didn't have to post that. If, if that's your man and that's your folks and all that kind of stuff, you don't post that kind of stuff about your folks, especially if it's true, especially if it's not true for both of the same reasons. You feel me? So, Milagano, you a Gilligano, but you're making some points. And people did speak up on that. They did, bro. But it's just like the streets is messed up because... All honestly, I don't see nobody speak up on it for real, for real, but you. I could be wrong. I could be wrong, and somebody else did it beside Milk. Let me know, let me know, let me know. But the only person I saw really talking about it like that is Milagano because he's a Gilligano. All you got to do is have some dough, some bread, some stacks of money, some clout, and you'll be okay. Like, you could really, I, I mean, I'm not saying this is 03, but you could be like a, a, a Jeebo Ganiston. If he came right now and he had a lot of money, there would be a lot of people, you know, that are probably... You know, um, reconcile their differences with that man and be cool with him, bro. But like I said, I just don't like how this played out. Now, that is true. You know what I'm saying? Money make a lot of people lose their morals, for sure, for sure. I give them that. I don't like that. Now you praying on the weed. But that's just what I think. But I want to know how y'all feel, what y'all think. All right, so that's enough for Milligano to Gilligano. Um, you're not going to do nothing, Milk. If you feel so mad about it, go say something. Go do something. Make a video about it. Simple. Either way, go to like, comment, subscribe for more of this content, though. Hit that subscribe button. Become a part of this Rich Trevor Mafia. Hit that notification bell right there at the top. Hit all. Stay tapped in for the latest and the greatest of what we got going on here at TNN Trap News Network. News you can use and some knowledge you can't get in college. Find me on all streaming platforms. Rich Trapper, Game 6. Rich Trapper, worth more than money. Rich Trapper, I'm better off without you. My two singles, Start From Scratch and Nightmare Before Christmas. They both out now as well as my newest project. I'm still better off without you. Make sure you go get that. Find me on all streaming platforms. Game 6 is out now. Go get it. I said that twice. Don't worry about it, though. Um, Instagram, Trap News Network, T-R-A-P-N-E-W-S-N-E-T-W-O-R-X. That's Trap News Network. Find me on that, man. And uh, we finna slide up out of here to the next one, though. Y'all be safe. And as always, if you're trying to figure out how to get $100, hit that red dot, slide it to the left. We're going to break that down. And Free Avenue Angel until he's free. Gone.